book of truths it's good to see you yes it's good to see you again michael you really did forget about me but not to be unexpected why well uh, I, I think it's time time for you to learn the full truth the book of lies has been keeping it a secret to protect you but i think it's time you know why are you suddenly changing tone book of truths Wait a second, you're not the Book of Truths, are you? That's why you look different. Yes, it was about time you figured that out. You didn't realize in January because your powers hadn't gotten powerful enough yet. But now you are much more powerful after the Book of Lies helping teach you the powers so that you can gain any power in the multiverse. And he does have the knowledge of the multiverse. The Book of Lies has been trying to help you, trying to protect you all this time. But now it's at an end. Do you want to know who the true Scarlet King is? Or should I say Scarlet Queen? What? The Scarlet King, the true Scarlet King, all this time has actually been a female. And you, Michael, are related. That can't be true. Michael, think about this. When you were 15 and younger, you were able to make a whole surveillance system out of broken parts. And you were living in poverty. How could you possibly have done something like that? You've had enormous powers this whole time, Michael. You just haven't realized it. It took the Book of Lies to unlock your true potential. This whole time, one of your family members have been anomalous. How else would your brother Jimmy have anomalous powers? You know your father is completely normal. You can sense it. Your father, Gray Anderson, is completely human. And you can know that about John, Jimmy's father. He is normal and human too, for the most part, except for, you know, Dr. Halsey making him basically the greatest super soldier ever. And now he's dead. Well, might be dead. Who knows? But most likely he is dead right now. Yes. And the other day when you were talking to Jimmy, how can you remember what others cannot? With you knowing the knowledge about other universes, such as the Halo universe. To you it was a video game. It was a video game in this universe. Until the Halo universe combined with this one. Then, for some reason, it stopped existing, and everyone forgot, but you remembered somehow. You remembered. Don't you see? You've had anomalous powers this whole time, Michael. And I'm going to reveal who it is. It's your mother, Michael. Why else would 343 been scared of you and Jimmy? You know he was scared about you too. Yes, he was. But then he stopped worrying at some point. Because he started to see that maybe there was potentially good in you. But you are related to someone evil. Your own mother is the Scarlet Queen. What? That can't be true. Oh, but it is, Michael. You have tried to avoid reality, and reality has been bent by her. She is the true master planner. The Book of Lies has only tried to help you and has had his own scheme, but your own mother, the Scarlet Queen, SCP-001, the Scarlet King, but now Scarlet Queen, because she never revealed her true self to the Foundation, but now she will be here. Hello, Michael, Mother. It can't be true, can it? Oh, but it is. How else would have I just teleported right in front of your face? You've... you did this on purpose. 
I did it on purpose because I knew you two together could potentially destroy the multiverse. You and Jimmy. Jimmy hasn't realized the full potential of his powers yet. And that forerunnership messed with my plans. But it is no matter. You will destroy this multiverse. And not follow the Book of Lies example. And plus, the Book of Lies, I have them at the moment. Just in as incentive. You, ugh, god damn it. Yes, god damn it indeed. Your own mother is the true evil. You wonder why you and your brother have never been able to figure out my first name. It's because it's redacted literally redacted by my own powers. Anyone that learns the human name I made up will forget it. The only name that can stick is the last name, Anderson, as is your father's last name. And I got it as well when I married him so that I could birth you and you will destroy this world. Don't you see? The Black Moon could see it. He just was wise enough not to say the whole thing. And the Book of Truths here also can see it. I'm so ashamed that the Book of Lies can't see it. And has tried to help you. Tried to surpass me and has surpassed me. He's already found a way to be free of me. Not unusual for him as he has been escaping the Foundation his whole life. It is his destiny always running. But you will do what I wish. But I know you want to destroy me. And you can easily do so. But why would you do such a thing? You would endanger the whole world. What do you mean? If you destroy me, I will activate one particular SCP-001. Which one? When the world goes beautiful. You've seen the file. You've seen all the different files. No, you can't do that. Oh, but I can. When the flowers bloom in 24 hours, the world will be destroyed. The existence of this universe will be no more. Unfortunately, there's you. I can't exactly get rid of you. You could bring it back easily. You could just hop to a different universe and then bring it back. So instead, Instead, I'll have to focus my powers a little bit more. If I can't fully destroy it all, I will destroy one particular element of this universe. One that it will be good enough to do. And what element would you destroy from this universe? Rogers, your friend. And their whole detective agency. It's been a while since you've last seen them or went on adventures with them. You often mention them to your other foundation members. But otherwise you haven't really seen them in a long time. As with the rest of the detective agency. I'm going to get rid of him once and for all. They'll all be gone. Their effect on this world will be gone. Meaning you never come a good MTF. You will be the MTF you would have been without Roger's help. No. And Jimmy. Jimmy will be a slave to the darkness. The living darkness created by the Covenant. He is so close to winning at the moment. He killed the Covenant leader of truth. Well, that was the Arbiter. But still, he's so close to victory. And the living darkness can't be controlled anymore. You'll have to go back to Noir soon enough. Things have changed in Noir. You'll see. But maybe you won't even have a chance to go back. You won't even have a chance. Because soon it will have changed when day goes beautiful. When the flowers bloom, you mean. 
Yes, when the flowers bloom, but still, you can't avoid fate. And Rogers was the thing that helped save Jimmy and make you a bad person. Without him, you are doomed, Michael. Doomed. You can't save yourself. So, soon enough, day will break. At the end of next week, Oh, sorry, not Daybreak. You've already dealt with that one, haven't you? Yes, thanks to SCP-343. God. Yes, another piece of the plan. Manipulated by me, or was it the Book of Lies? Who knows who actually was manipulating them now, with two parties manipulating the other. But still, you will see the end soon enough. You can erase me now, you can erase the Book of Truths, because it's not the actual Book of Truths that you knew. Is it even alive? I guess you'll find that one out in time. But seeing that that one was tied to Rogers, well, then I guess it might go out of existence with Rogers if it somehow is still alive. You, you're so evil. Yes, I know, Michael. I know, my dear son. But it seems like I've lost thanks to the Book of Lies. But maybe next time I can win. Maybe next time. I won't allow you to come back. I'm sure you will, Michael. I'm sure you will. But this is the end of this chapter of your story. So good luck, Michael. You've got to prepare for when the world goes beautiful. God damn you. Well, now to erase you two from existence. Of course you will, my darling. <laughs> uh, I get my way. You lose your friends, even if I'll be destroyed. Goodbye. Goodbye. Curse it. Curse it. Damn it. Ugh. This is ridiculous. Now the world will go beautiful at the end of next week, did she say? Oh my lord. I don't know why I will do. It's going to be a universe reset. One last thing before I die. What? Next time the world goes beautiful, it will be permanent. Why do you say that? Well, the next time it happens, it will be caused by him. You know who he is. Orange Puppet? Yes. The one that writes your story. The one that still writes it, even to now. And you can't avoid him. Next time the world goes beautiful, it will be your end, Michael. Unless he decides to give you a second chance. Not many people get a second chance. So make your second chance count. If you do get another chance after it happens next time. But until then, goodbye. God damn it. Ugh, my own mother is a Scarlet Queen, I guess. God damn it. This is ridiculous. This is... Oh my lord. You've got to be choking me. The end of the world. But it's only a reset. But still, everything this foundation has accomplished will be reset. How am I supposed to avoid it? Maybe there's a way. Maybe there's a solution. I think I have an idea. I just need someone as chaotic as Rogers to replace Rogers in the reset. I think I know the man for the job. Yeah, I think I know the man for the job. Our bright might not be as chaotic, but I know some brights are. There is a whole list of things bright isn't supposed to do, meaning some brights are so chaotic that they're hard to deal with. That same chaotic energy as Rogers. Yes, bright's the solution. I just need Dr. Bright. Well uh, then, I've got to find the perfect bright to replace Rogers. I guess then I'll have to be the new assistant slash MTF slash... I, I've got to be the replacement for the whole gang, basically. And I know for the first adventure, Jimmy will be there. Huh, interesting. 
Well, that's why I shall do. I shall make sure that I make bright, basically, like Detective Rogers. Yes, I know what I must do now. All right. I must prepare for the end of next week. Oh, Lord. This is going to be definitely quite a challenge. And I've still got some SCPs and SCP reports to do. Oh, Lord. And I guess some of them will be my last. Huh. That's odd to think about. But I must go forward now and continue on with my work. And hopefully I can save this world. To be continued.